y'all welcome back to the channel if you are new here my name is mariah don't forget to like comment and subscribe um today i am going to be running some errands today when kevin gets home um but i want to show you guys i need a tree topper i don't want to do a star i don't like stars on top of trees i just don't like stars um, when, we, when we were little, my mom used to have um, these porcelain dolls that she used to put on top of a tree, which was so pretty. So I want to go find a tree topper, but I want to give you guys a short little tour of the things that I got for the tree, for the house. So let's be yeah, I wanted to give you guys a kind of tour haul ish, if you will video vlog because i am going to the store because i need more stuff but i want to show you guys what i already have in the house so if you're interested let's get into it all right so this is the tree right now like i said i do need a tree topper right here but let's get into these two first i got both of them from target um they both were three dollars and um every year um me and kevin like to get the kids one new ornament a piece um so these two this one i got last year from walmart and i also got this one from walmart as well for rome that one's for zuri and this year it was these two the elf and the ballerina since zuri has been so interested in ballerinas i thought it was so cute it doesn't match the tree but it's okay um so these red berries i got from amazon it came in a pack of 20 so i just put it in different places around the tree and let's see this was a gift from kevin's best friends the mom um it says he actually said yes 11 4 to 11 4 2018 that's when he proposed and um, these were from when we first got the tree. This was back in 2018, I believe that says. He tried to write the, the date on it, but um, what does it say? This was 2017. So he has a K and my M is right here. And this is Zuri's um, first Christmas in 2018. Someone got that made for us, which is so cute. And this was her very first ornament that we made her. And I got this little thing from Walmart. It was like $2. So yeah. So looking at the tree, I need some more um, of this kind of green ornament to go on the tree because I want to... If y'all haven't noticed, I love traditional trees. I mean, I love the green, the reds, and the golds um, type decorations. So I want to get more of that green and that red to go on the tree. Because I have a lot of gold. I do have some silver in there, which I'm going to take off because I really don't like it. So, yeah, I just want to give you guys a quick little tutorial of, not tutorial, but little visual of our tree so far. I think it's very cute. But, yeah. So, yeah, um, oh, and we have a garland on the, the, the stairs. I still want to get some ornaments to go on this thing right here, and it kind of comes down a little bit. So, yeah, I want to get some ornaments to go on that. And I'm going to show you guys my wreath that I just finished. Um, you'll see clips of me making it. And um, if you remember for fall, I made my um, fall wreath by myself. And I'm gonna show you guys what I did to this one to put on the door. Oh, that's what I need. I need to get a door hanger for the wreath. Yeah. And I wanna get a sign to go outside, but I think I'm gonna get that from Hobby Lobby. I think I'm gonna get that from Hobby Lobby, which I'm not going to today, cause it's, so yeah, I'm going to just go to my favorite store, Target. 
But yeah, let me show y'all my wreath. so this is my wreath it kind of looks, it's a little sideways but um i was gonna get a regular green one like the tree but i wanted to get this one because of the smell and i wanted to make sure the wreath and the tree kind of matched so um i just put the leftover ribbon that i got oh i didn't tell you guys i got this ribbon from amazon because no one no store here had that kind of ribbon so i found it on amazon so i just split up the the ribbon for the tree and for the wreath and i hot glued everything on so it won't come off i put some of those red berries in there and yeah so this is going to go on the door i just need to get a um a wreath hanger for the door and like i said we're going to go get us a tree topper so yeah all right, y'all, so we're in the car. I am going to, I forgot I have to take some, I have to drop some packages off. I have to ship those out. Well, drop some orders off at the UPS store and ship those. And the trash man has been late the past couple weeks. Y'all supposed to get there at nine. It is five o'clock. see exactly what I wanted in there well I saw one thing but then when I got to the line it was extremely long and I wanted to wait I gotta get to UPS and I gotta get home so I can cook and I wasn't waiting in that line I'm off tomorrow so I can just go tomorrow we're gonna slide on over to Publix and then UPS Sorry, sir. That man had an attitude. Should have bumped your car, bitch. I just hate when people are so rude. Jesus Christ. It is totally free to be nice in this world. God dang. So I think it's just a bad day of shopping because no store had what I wanted. And I really want that oat milk. I mean, that oat milk. Well, that went right. Got order shipped. And um, so I'm back home 
shopping did not go as planned because I came back with nothing. Um, I'm not cooking anymore because Kevin is not hungry. So, I just gotta find something for me and the kids to eat. And yeah. So, yeah, this is the end of the vlog. Um, don't forget to subscribe on your way out. Like, give the video a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Go ahead and comment down below. And, um, yeah, for everyone that has already subscribed, already liked, already shared any videos of mine, I really appreciate you. We are on the journey to a 1,000 subscribers. And my first 100, I thank you guys for. So, um, yeah, be on the lookout for Vlogmas Episode 3. I'm filming a haul. So, what is that? So, yeah, I'll catch y'all in the next video. Bye.